Tonight, that's presented Gonzo by Global Credit Union. Yeah, Christian Walker in the league in strikeouts, and he has had a sensational season. Yeah, he's pitched on a multi-year deal to be that stabilizer out there in the middle. Diamondbacks and the Mets. Near Casino, Arizona, player to watch. Vientos, the rookie third baseman, half a step in on the grass at third. And the catcher's mound. It's done. Come pretty close. There's the ghost fork ball. Left it up, threw it for a strike. Corbin pops this up. Alvarez gets a late look, but it's up against the Mets. Ball out to center. Nimmo, late break coming in. And it gets under it. Marte takes a cut. Got the sweeper that time. Senga's got the whole bag of tricks out. He is 30 years old. Just about done with his first season in the U.S. After getting... Very successful career for the SoftBank Hawks, a three-time All-Star. Trying to fool him, threw a fastball down, it's two and two. Boy dotted it at 98 right on the corner. And there's two up that fork ball, and then all of a sudden he comes right back with that fastball down in the strike zone. Tommy enjoying a productive return to City Field where he began this year as a Met. There's that fork ball. And you'll see that. Doubled up with it. That has been his signature. Is that the way to beat this pitch? Well, I think I think it's you try to get him early. The pitch, see it up as yeah, Bob see always it up. says. And Tommy fam, what a series he's had. That was the fork ball right there, Tommy. He didn't do a lot of movement there. He just kind of picked his toe up, put it right back down, and just swatted it over. They desperately need him to figure it out here. Last chance on the trip. Christian is two for 20 out of there. Oh, need one was, more of those. Yeah, and that was a nice pitch. He got it about thigh high. That fork ball caught the bottom of the zone. This boy can go with that fork ball again. Lost the handle on that fork ball, sailed way up all major league starters. Fastball. Oh, my goodness, Bill Miller. Christian can't believe it, and you don't on this fastball. All right. And Merrill Kelly does not have a ghost fork ball. He does have six major league quality pitch. Nimmo's had a productive week. Five hits in the series. They had two balls and one strike. That fastball got the corner two and two. Take some out of that box. Hey. Called strike three. There you go. There you go. Got the sinker. Able to figure out nine for 24 this season against the Diamondbacks. Boy, Merrill looks like he's dotting these fastballs. See how many more inches you can get. Runs the fastball in that time, and it's 0 and 2. A 4 10 Eastern time start this afternoon. Another. Foul ball, a cutter that time for Merrill. Yeah, he got. And Zach coming off a disappointing game last night. Now we look to Merrill to salvage a split. San Francisco comes in for two. Merrill Kelly, two batters and two strikeouts. Got Boy, just a good spot to throw that cut fastball up and out in that strike zone. Let's get a look around the diamond now. Brought to us by E.D. Mar Fun guy to be around in that locker room. Proud Papa. Baby boy, Gabby Jr. boy in the uh, all three of those hits are home runs. And he spits on that changeup. It's one and two. But then again, that strike zone and the shadows. The Shannon knows. Alonzo, four hits, five. One, two. He'll the line. Tommy's got it, Tommy Pham. Kelly, two strikeouts, and then this beauty by Tommy Pham. We are scoreless after one in New York. Around the league, former Tiger great Buck Farmer facing his old team, and there's Detroit's Matt Beerling. With cannot finish even with Cincinnati. They would lose on the tiebreaker based on the series record this year. On the mound against former Diamondback Chase Anderson. And the Marlins are playing a day game today at Milwaukee. Well, eventually you're going to get that ghost fork ball, and Senga had... Guriel single twice, knocked the wing at it. Big first pitch swinger. Fork ball bounces up there. One ball and one strike. Guriel turns on one, but 
Yanks it just foul down. The Guess what pitch that was. Well, that's again that strikeouts for Kodai Senga. Here you see the rotation. Ball just deep. In Orlando, where he and his wife Rosmila gave birth to their first child this week. Nimmo coming over from center field. All game split the series. That's the mission here today. But Stewart's had himself a very good series. And Merrill Kelly, you can talk all you want about the ghost fork ball, but Merrill. Merrill had two strikeouts and a one, two, three first. Doubles up on that change up right there. Along the right field line, Corbin Carroll fighting the sun. Does he see it? The home plate area is in sunlight. McNeil fights off a curveball. Near the on deck circle, Moreno has one Francisco Alvarez, who has tortured the Diamondbacks all year long. He's played four games, third of the year. Four games again. Guys have really done a fantastic job this year in their first seasons. And cutters the strikes is over. Yes, he went. Roberto Ortiz rings him up. Three. That's to he and Rosmila. No doubt, Jody. You just you feel better about things when Gabby's back there, Gonzo. Things are under control. You know, guy like Gallon is a very routine guy, and we all know that. He's oh yeah, the the routinist if there's such a thing. What you like, instead of being in that pattern where two guys are almost thinking the same, it makes it very difficult. Oh boy, Kodai Senga and that goes for ball five. Look at that that drop on that four. One of these guys can hammer it. Vientos comes in at third a step. And Geraldo. Oh. Fastball's low at 97. Not only did it's part of a bigger pitch mix for him. The run, Brandon Nimmo gets to the spot. Swing and miss goes for it ball. Throws it up in the zone there for ball one to Corbin Carroll. Corp. And Alvarez, the rookie back there, he just gets real comfortable. I mean, they're all just with pitch framing. And one of the first catchers that ever did that was Tony Pena. He used to. There's that Tony Pena leg. Corbin got the cutter. It's two and two. Two to Corbin. Ouch. That one caught Alvarez back there. Pretty good. Yeah, it did. A lot of catchers. Try to get that right arm behind. There's another fork ball. Senga has the DH leads off the Met third against Merrill Kelly. Vogelback struck out as a wooden check. That's that good Merrill Kelly check. Vogelback hitting 227. Was traded here from Pittsburgh at midseason last year. And he still does have that occasional thump. 